the line x cos alpha plus y sin alpha equals p is the tangent to the ellipse then show that a square cos square alpha plus b square sin square alpha is equal to b square one method with which you can do this question is the parametric form and the other method is that when we simply take x1 comma y1 to be the point of contact point of contact it means the point at the curve through which the tangent is passing now differentiating for the slope taking two common and putting that below zero Now making the equation of the tangent cross multiplying. Shifting the variables on one side and the constants on the other side. Now dividing both the sides by a square b square. We get And now we can cancel b square with b square here and a square with a square. Also b square on this side and a square on this side. Leaving behind now because point of contact has to hold the curve Therefore, will be equal to 1. So this side turns to 1. So equation of the tangent at x1, y1 will be this. Now this is the tangent. And they are saying x cos omega plus y sin omega is the tangent. So we can compare the two, first and second, we can compare the two, because both are the tangents. So there is a rule that if two lines are same, then a1 by a2 is equal to b1 by b2 is equal to c1 by c2. That is, x1 over a square upon cos alpha is equal to y1 over b square upon sin alpha is equal to 1 upon p. Now, if I take first with third then we can relay that x1 is a square cos alpha by p and same way if we take the second and connect that with third then y1 is b square sin alpha by p 
and we can put that in the original equation now by putting these two components that is the x component and the y component in the original equation we get the original equation is this obviously that will hold x1 and y1 so we get E square can be cancelled with this and same with B square cancel with B to the power 4 so we are now left with and we can cross multiply this B square and we get the answer hence prove that E square cos square alpha plus B square sine square alpha is equal to B square this is very important question so you can watch it again and the main concept here is to connect the two different equations with the help of uh, linear equations and initially you used the differentiation. Thank you very much.